Uh, hello? Oh, hold on, where's the mouse? Um, hold on. Um, oh, there it goes. Sorry, I couldn't figure out my mouse, where my mouse was. Um, so recently I've been spending more time in the free build. Um, because I want to try out some new cases and stuff, which I thought would be cool, because... Because in, um, the story mode, you kind of just get, like, basic cases like this. And I've been wanting to try out the water cooling and different cases, which I thought were cool. So that's pretty much just what I'm going to be doing here. Um, hold on. Bring out my other one. Um, it was this one. This one was the main one that I wanted to come over and try. Because the case for it is really small. And I thought that was pretty cool because it has no like outside it has interior in here right here which basically is just something to keep it all attached to so you can't just pull out one piece but um yeah this was my first time doing the water cooling which I thought was really cool um originally it did take me a minute to figure out how it worked because if I go install and custom water cooling, um, there's a bunch of different water cooling things which I didn't completely understand at first. Well, I mean, they're not that hard to understand, but like, didn't understand which one would be best. And before, I didn't know what these were. So, for quite a few times, I was trying to run my... my um, I was trying to run my PC without water and the water cooling things. And um, when I was trying to load it up on the computer, the blue screen kept popping up saying error. Same thing that happens when you forget the thermal paste. Ooh, I didn't know what that. I didn't know. Huh, I didn't know that was a thing. It shows a number on it. I don't know what the number means, but I didn't know it did that. But um, yeah, I come in here and. I think it's pretty cool. It was pretty fun to build because it was my first time working on one of these PCs, which was pretty cool. I keep saying it's cool, but um, yeah, I enjoyed it. It was because it gave me a challenge. It's not just the normal wires and connect this and that to this and that. And I've also been working on this one. This one's like, it's, what is it? I don't remember what the case was called. Gamer Storm Quad Stellar. And I haven't quite got this one to, well, it works. It, it turns on and everything. But if I come over to here, it's got nine slots for storage. But if you, so like, no matter what, well, from the ones I've tried, I've, put in a bunch of PFUs and none of them have been able to intake all nine storage drives and it's been kind of not really annoying it's just I've been having to come through install I come over here to power supplies and I've gone through here a couple of times trying to find any that were bigger like there's this one that I've tried that one can hold that only five extra still out that don't have, or that can't plug into the PSU. So I've just been coming through here, going through these, trying to find one that can fit all nine of them. Um, originally, I, so for real PCs, whoops, for real PCs, you can have a second PSU, but you can only have, like, like, you can't connect one storage device to one PSU in real life, so you have to, like, designate them, and most PCs don't have to, so it's kind of weird. So, I've been trying to Google it and see if there was a way for me to install two PSUs, and there's, I don't, at least I don't think there is so far, which was a little disappointing. So, I've just been trying to figure out if there's anything else I can add into the extra slots. And I haven't, 
So if I come here, there's also more slots for uh, graphics cards, but I think it's because I have a water cooling. These take up a lot more room than normal ones would. So if I were to try and install them, here, like if I try and install them, move those, install, graphic card, custom water cooling, uh, where is it, not right here, water cool GPUs. So if I come here and I find one that I want, so we'll just go with this one. I try and install it and it, it shows that these are red. I mean, they're in the way and that's, I mean, there's not, I don't need more graphics cards. I still get like 140 frames on it, which is really nice, but it just feels like with this case and water cooling, there's a lot of wasted space that I could have a lot more things in. And if I go cables, I believe, yeah, I have two fans, three fans, no, just two. I have two fans. I don't think I can, let me check. Nope, I can connect those, but never mind. I thought I couldn't connect my fans to my PS2 either. But um, yeah. So I I was thinking about going back through and making this case again, and instead of doing water cooling, just do normal, because I feel like with doing normal, I'll be I'd be able to fit more graphics cards at least and doing it again would at least let me think or give me time to think of another way to either fill or fit all nine drives into the one PS view. Um, I still do the story mode sometimes. It's just sometimes it gets a bit repetitive repetitive because you just do the same case and same fixes over and over again. And it's just fun to to try things that you don't normally get to try in the story mode. Um, this is a PC I was just messing around with. This was the first one I tried to do the water cooling in. Didn't work very well. Uh, didn't get very far either, but it was still pretty fun. I enjoyed it. Um, yeah, that's what I've been working on recently. Uh, bye bye, and thanks.